Microsoft don't want you to install Windows 11 on unsupported hardware because they have removed the official guide for installing Windows 11 on unsupported hardware. Let me tell you one thing in starting. You can comment down. I will let you know the very easiest method to install Windows 11 on unsupported hardware by just one single command. You will not lose any security update. If you want, let me know in the comment. So this is the official Microsoft guide like ways to install Windows 11. Currently, you can't see the not recommended method because they don't want to promote these kind of things. Things. but the good news is that method still works and let me show you how it was looking earlier we have archive link here so you can see other ways to install windows 11 not recommended you can see here registry trick if you don't have supported tpm and cpu you can follow this to upgrade or install windows 11 on unsupported hardware let me tell you the main reason why they are removing it first thing they don't want to promote these things another thing is like new support rule microsoft want users to upgrade to windows 11 to newer computers that fits for windows 11 requirement and windows 10 support is ending on 14th october 2025 that's why they remove it you have to buy a new pc or upgrade your hardware another reason is the guide involved changing the system setting which could cause issues that makes computers less secure the point is what happens if you install windows 11 on unsupported hardware first thing is lack of updates your pc will not receive security updates which microsoft put for compatible systems another reason is compatibility issues they are pushing updates somehow you install it but those updates are not compatible with your hardware so you will get here bugs some blue screen issues the problem is microsoft developer not considering the unsupported hardware so they are not making software or fixing bugs for unsupported hardware if they push any update that is not for your uncompatible pcs and then your system is going to be in problem that's why they remove it